Hey, what's going on everybody? So I'm here at the grocery store and I wanted to simply explain to you what is the zero zero rule and what a better place to actually apply it. So right behind me is a bunch of vegetables, right? So we remember the zero zero rule is about zero fat or zero carbohydrate or zero protein. So you got those three factors. So those three factors make up your foods. So if you're gonna have primarily all carbohydrates, then protein and fat are more than likely gonna have zero value in that food source, uh, committing to your calories and everything like that. So you got things like your carbs, your, your vegetables, that's a zero, zero rule all day. Let's go ahead and find one where we actually break the rule of a zero, zero rule, okay? Now let's go over to, well, the bread, the pastries. Well, we're gonna actually mess up the whole entire zero, zero rule there because let's take a look. We're actually going to see that we're taking fat and carbs and we're mixing them together in one. That's totally breaking the zero, zero rule. Now let's go over here, let's get some fruit. Here's a banana. Do we have any fat or protein inside of a banana? Not really, that's all zero, zero rule right there. Now, what if you are a person that's really about the ketogenic diet, right? Where's that fit in? Well, we're not gonna have so many vegetables, okay? So you're gonna have whole foods there, but then, oh, well, what's in this? Well, that's fat and protein, so that's zero, zero. There's no carbs in the other thing there. So it applies to the zero, zero rule, and it's going to be able to let you shift around what kind of diet you're gonna be on, or if you're planning your meal plans and how you're gonna be getting your caloric intake, what is the resources that you're gonna be able to do this with? One last one, here we go, you tell me. That's some bread right there. Is that a zero, zero friendly rule right there? You tell me. Next time you're at the grocery store, apply the zero, zero rule, download the ebook, get a little bit more information about it, start using this rule, and you're gonna have a happy time doing your nutritional shopping.